Hello guys and welcome back to some more Let's Play Europa Universalis 4 as Karaman. So we have been doing quite well for, well for ourselves. I mean, it's been quite a while though into the game uh, and we haven't expanded that much. But I think from our starting position we have been doing quite well. Do we still have those cores by the way? <laughs> we do, that's hilarious. Uh, but it's only, it's about 60 years or so until they will disappear though, so... Yeah. A little bit more but still... That is indeed something. Okay, anyone have a disputed succession? Nope. So yeah, we tried to claim Begal's throne, it failed miserably, and now we have problems. Yeah, yeah. Uh, once the truce run out, runs out, I will be declaring war on, war on them again. Which is nice. Hopefully, I only need to do two more wars or, uh, for basically to get Bengal under my control. I don't know for sure though, but that's uh, that's what I'm hoping for anyways. That's what I'm aiming for. In the meantime, we could try and consider a war against Delhi, but uh, we are over our limit now, so I think I'm actually just gonna cancel that marriage immediately. Or well, actually, I don't know. Is there anything sort of a little bit more derpy we can cancel? Um, so we have one, two, three vassals, one, two, uh, yeah, one, two, three marriages. What's the fifth relation? We are married. Oh, we have four vassals: Kachar, Jampur, Gujarat, and Khorasan. Yeah, that explains it. So we need to cancel our marriage. Uh, cancel our marriage with either Persia or Bengal. One of the two. Kind of don't feel like cancelling it with anyone. I'm going to cancel it with Bengal eventually, but they have been dealing with a lot of disputed succession lately. And uh, I would like if I could uh, actually claim their throne, because that would really... It would mean that I'll, that I'll only have to fight one war to get them. But let's wait. Oh, well, no, fuck it. Let's just cancel that stupid marriage. Fuck it. Kill my stability. Which is what I usually do. Can't even afford to get it back. Oh, God. Because of our overextension and religious unity, ugh. Yeah, that religious unity is indeed going to be problematic. How long until I get my next idea group? Mm, only one technology. Very nice. Once I get that, I'll be able to have religious ideas, which is going to be very sweet. Nice! Hindu zealots! Go, 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 go! Uh, well, it depends though. If they convert uh, the nation of Bengal to Hinduism, then that's going to suck. But if they form an independent nation, that's going to be awesome, because that's going to reduce the amount of war wars I'll have to fight. Which would be nice. Military engineer or get local defensiveness. I like that. Permanent castle spelling? Sure. I really should start investing in technology though. I haven't done that a single time since I began this game. Which is kind of sad. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> Neighbor bonus by 25. That's kind of a lot. But I really want to finish these ideas though. What do I get, actually, once I do that? I get... Lowered stability, which is going to be very nice. That's going to, I think that's going to allow me to cancel marriages without having to lose stability. Which is so good. Alright, so Zao is collapsing. That's very good. Liberals, nice. Very, very good. Uh, the reason for that is because they are under a union with the Oirat Horde, which is very scary. That's a union I don't want to... I don't want it to be a thing, so... Now you know. Okay, here we go. This might be good. Buddhist zealot. So either... Uh, oh god, they're going to give the land to Pegu or Ayatai. If they give it to I Well, oh god, both of these nations are super powerful. So regardless of who they give it to, it's going to be very bad for me. But uh, I'll, I'll let them do whatever. I'll, I'm, I'm going to let them do their thing. Oh, we should be able to win that. Yes, good. And now he decides to respond to his fucking... Oh god, and he's getting defeated. Yeah, these guys are collapsing. Sad thing, I can't even help them out because they, um... I can, actually. No, I can only offer them access. Uh, let's actually do that. Let's actually just do that. Yeah. Oh, man, oh, man. Uh, Aoud has a castle... Oh, really? You don't have... Oh, yes, you do. Yeah, how long do these cores last? 72, so we need to get them at some point soon. Yeah, I'll re I really want these cores to... Uh, I want to give them to Jumper. That would be very nice. I'll, I'll need to come up with an excuse to declare war on Delhi soon. Just not right now, though. I have far too much other crap going on. Counter-Reformation is officially a thing. Alright. 
Right, is this truth gonna run out soon? I am impatient. Yes, very soon now. Very soon, and we'll, we'll, we'll be ready to declare another war. Yeah. Yeah. By the way, does, that, does my voice sound any different? Because I'm... I've attached my microphone to the other side of the headset because the other side just stopped working. I really need to buy a m new microphone. I'm, I think I'm gonna do that like once I'm done uh, recording this. I'll, I'm, I have to order it though, so it's gonna be a while until I can actually get it. But still, I really want to get that shit back working. I, I think my headset is very good, it's just that it, the microphone is so bad. Well, the microphone itself is good, it's just that it, it, it gets destroyed so quickly. So, yeah. That's a problem. Yeah, I'm not improving relations with these people, which is bad, because uh, I can already start annexing. I, I could have already have begun annexing all these people. Yeah. Although, I'm not going to start annexing anyone, though, until I can begin annexing uh, Gujarat, so... I think we might have to sit around with quite a lot of vassals for a while. Which is fine, though. I do have those very sweet ideas. Right. Is the truce going to expire soon? Come on. Come on, little truce truce. Uh, yeah, that makes sense. Oh god, they collapsed, and now they are Hindu! No! I thought they were going to... Oh, fuck. Oh, crap. That's a problem. That's indeed a very big problem. <laughs> it's gonna take over a over a hundred years to actually annex Bengal. I actually kind of didn't think about that. Hmm. Yeah, I'm starting to think I might not actually make these guys a vassal because I have so many very bad modifiers with them that annexing them is just not gonna happen. I have this. Yeah, you know what? I think I might just actually conquer them. If I'm gonna do that though, I need to actually core these things. Yep, that's how quickly I changed my opinion about the whole subject. You're allied to Delhi. Well, I mean, I guess, if you really want to. I don't care, though. I will declare war regardless. Let's actually quickly, though, cancel... Cancel that, I guess. Yeah, fuck it, we're not gonna make these guys a vassal. Now that they have changed their religion, it's going to be even more impossible to get it done, so... So, you are fabricating claims, but you are still under the Union, right? Please say you are. <gasps> the Giant Guard is no longer in, under the Union. Oh, crap. That's very bad. Because that means that uh, they can attack me any moment now. Which means I need to build more armies. Because I'm not strong enough at the moment to defend from Vagina Gar. Crap. <laughs> this is actually going to increase my piety. That's great. Alright, let's uh, go ahead and increase our maintenance. Morale going. Just like that. Get some generals. At least one. At least one general. And then war it is. And I don't really care if Delhi joins. That would actually just be just as fine. I kind of want to fuck. I kind of want to fuck up Delhi, anyways. So I'm fine with that. Alright, uh, come on, let me... Fucking... Why can't I go in here? There we go, finally. It just took a while, that's all. Don't know why, but it did. Alright, let's take this army and move over there, so that we can join up with our vassal, and hopefully we can... Um, take them down. Or we can at least defend from Delhi until we are done with the sieges in Bengal. God, we're gonna take so much aggressive expansion from doing this. It's gonna be quite bad. Should actually, I should have fabricated claims when I think about it. This was a dumb idea. Oh well. So cannot improve relations. Oh god, we can actually annex them. Ooh. Praise the lord. Well, no, we can't do it now anyways, though, so... We'll have to wait. Oh, nice. Hello. I see you exist. Uh, let me help you with that, actually. There we go. Annihilation! Like a bouse. Fuck yeah. Alright. And uh, then we split up. That's pretty much how everything's gonna go down here. 
and we shall siege it all. We shall give stuff back to my vassal. I might, I might try to ask them to release Punjab. If they, if they would do that, I would most appreciate it. I would have most appreciated it. Yes. Alright, so that one is done. Uh, so we can no. Let's just go siege them. Yep, here they come. Uh, well, hello guys, and welcome to to death. Hope you have a shitty time. Okay, no, th those are my territories. Uh, what am I even doing? All right, split these guys up. Get some conversions going. And these ones are still taking a while. Okay, let's go over here and join up. And let's finish this stupid war. Okay, can you? Why, where are you going exactly? I kind of want you to die, so. If you would just do that, and I would appreciate it. Yeah, let's go kill them. Don't want them to be running around. Oh god. No, actually these guys can go deal with that. And then you guys can keep going over here and siege more Delian land. We gain the Casas Belly somehow. Against the Ayutayans, which I'm not going to be fighting anyway, so it doesn't matter. Brittany has uh, religious civil disorder or, or whatever. Uh, nice! Bunch of prestige out of nowhere. Fuck yeah. 99 prestige actually at this point. Very cool. Oh, hello. You can't decide, can you, what you want to do? I still don't have uh, force much, do I? I don't think I do. No, two, one more idea and I'll get it. One more idea. That's fine, I can wait. Of course, I'm going to be spending all my points on coring shit now, though, so... It's going to be the Norwegian... It's going to, it's going to be the Norwegian campaign all over again. <laughs> oh, by the way, I won't be able to annex these guys, because a very big modifier here is the fact that we are in a war together. Fuck, I didn't think about that. Uh, oh well. I don't know what I can do to make them like me even more. Right, but now we're sieging everything though, so... Yeah. But yeah, as I mentioned, I'm not going to do any more annexations. Oh, fuck yeah, per alliance with Persia. Fuck. Fuck yeah. Yeah, I'm not gonna... Yeah. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, so... If I don't know, did they improve relations with me? Uh, yes, they did. Finally, you understood that that was the only thing that was... Preventing us from allying each other. You are smart. You're actually kind of stupid, but you showed a little bit of smartness there in the end, so... I'm not gonna judge you too much. Uh, lose... I need that piety though, so I cannot do much about that. Yep. Need to get those conversions going. Oh, rebels. Uh, pretend rebels. Oh, no. Uh, let's go fix that. Let's go deal with that little issue. Upper Doab has been taken. Very nice. Alright, let's do this. Let's finish this shit. <laughs> Everyone one piece now. That's great. But uh, I am not ready quite yet, no. France. By the way, when will we get access to an embassy? Is it in this technology? Does it even say? Buildings. Plantations, fine arts... Canal, dry dock, embassy. Embassy level 6. Okay, so that's why we haven't been able to build an embassy yet. Because we have no technology in terms of um, diplomatic. Yeah, that's an, in that's an issue. So, these one coring soon? No, they're, they just stopped coring. Oh well. Alright guys, let's finish this job. Let us finish what we started. Die! Oh wow, I just wasted all my manpower. Well, that was a mistake. <laughs> it wasn't even worth it. Oh fuck. Oh well. Alright, now let's see what we can do here. I want you to return these cores. It's gonna be that expensive, so we might not be able to do too much. Yeah, Punjab is just gonna be too expensive. Could do a smaller nation, like Mabad or Multan or something like that. 
could do like both of these nations. But truly, I don't think that would... Would that really be that good for me? I kind of almost would prefer to just save up for... I kind of just want to save up for uh, the ability to do Punjab. Nah. I don't care where you have course and where you don't have course. Could just do both of them just to weaken them a little bit. That might work out. Yeah. Let's just do it that way. And can I do anything else fancy? Like forcing you to annul some treaties? Nope. Alright. Uh, get away, get rid of your core, and uh, then we'll be done here. So I don't know if I want to try and vassalize Jangladesh and Mavat, or if I want to... I don't think I should though, because I would get o get get me over the limit again, and I have bad experiences with being too much over my limit. These guys, on the other hand, uh, we could do it like that. Would that bring us to the point where we could vassalize them next time around? I don't know. It would basically be the same as doing this, so... Ooh, it's close though. We could just straight out annex that, but I think I'll be better off by doing uh, something like that. Yeah. And then in the next war we can vassalize them. No, that's right, we didn't want to vassalize them. Uh, well, if that's the case, then... I kind of... Yeah... Oh, man, I don't know, man, man... Well, I, I knew, do know, I, I know I want to release these guys and make them a cute little vassal of mine. Um, and then I guess I should just annex this once I'm, once the next war comes around. Yeah. Oh, what the hell? Why not? I, there no, there's no way I'm going to be able to annex a Bengal vassal, or I could just straight out annex them and then re-release them as a vassal of mine. Of course, I've already began this coring, but I should be able to cancel that. Right? Just a test. Yeah, I can get my points back. So I think I might actually just do that instead. Yeah, let's do that. So it's, uh, yeah, I'll just straight out annex them and then I'll release them all over again as a vassal so that I don't get those nasty penalties that I have at the moment. Nill your treaties again. And, uh. And, uh, yeah. We should be closing in on... Yeah, we're dangerously overextended at this point. But in five years, that will end, so... So they have the wrong religion, so we'll have to declare war on them if we want to. But I'm going to guarantee them, though. Because I don't want them to get conquered by a Vaginagar. It's my little nation, not Vaginagars. Ooh, that's actually going to... Just going to that's going to give us... That's going to bring us over the limit anyways. Oh, crap. Uh, would you, by the way, become my vassal peacefully? I don't think there's any way they would. I didn't, by the way, check how close I was to be able to vassalize uh, Delhi in the next war. But seriously, though, I need to start annexing some people. So how close are you, Gajarat? You're not quite there yet. Unless there's something I do not know of. They have military access to our nation. I can send them a gift, but... Hmm... Yeah, I don't know of any tricks I can do, unless they have some rebels. So for now, we're just gonna have to have this problem going on. So I think we just might, we might just have to chill out for a while now. And do nothing. So, but that's fun too. No, it's not, but whatever. <laughs> We've actually restored Jampuri back to their original borders, that's awesome. So we can start annexing, uh, which I should probably just do, just to get it on over with, but... The thing is, I don't know, like, because I, I, I'm, I do need to start the annexation process of Gujarat before I finish the one with Jumper. But as, I guess I can just start it, and if I notice that I won't be able to start the annexation of Gujarat before I'm done with these guys, then I'll just start, uh, then I'll just cancel it, actually. Yeah, let's go talk to Corizan as well. Make sure they like me. 
Yep, we need to improve relations with them. Persia likes me enough anyway, so I'm not too worried about that. These guys won't be my vassal, and these guys we are already improving relations with. Alright, good. Nice, nice, nice. Alright, let's go down here and protect from rebels. Rebel scum. Yeah. Alright, oh crap, I'm losing money. Oh, fine. I'll lower the maintenance if that's what you want me to do. Any any good disputed successions at the moment? Ooh, the Ottomans. That is no way in hell we're going to be able to get a... No way in hell we're going to be able to claim the Ottoman throne. That's just not happening. Although, oh god, that is tempting though. Ugh. We won't actually be able to get one though. I'm actually going to try though, because if... Yeah, the Spirit of Succession. Or maybe they have an ear and he's just weak. He has a weak claim or something like that. Yeah, reason, Regency for Ahmed uh, Osmanli, if that's how you pronounce it, I don't know. I don't know if, I don't know what would happen if we claim the throne. I don't know if we would actually gain anything from that. Let's try it though. Uh, this is too much of a chance to just pass up. So let's go ahead and talk. Skip that one. And we'll go talk to the Ottomans. Oh, by the way, we need an annexation guy now if we're going to start annexing vassals again. There we go. That'll do the job. Alright, come on, Mr. Ottoman. Let's be bros forever and ever and ever and ever. Wouldn't that be just be great? <laughs> just getting a fucking personal union with the Ottomans. I actually got that once. I was playing as Persia, and I had uh, my empire was, was pretty big at that point. But still, though, just getting a casual fucking uh, personal union with the Ottomans that just blew my mind. So my empire was quite big at that point. <laughs> uh, yeah, <laughs> like the only thing I could think about when I played that campaign on my own was that oh god, why is this not a let's play? This would make for such a great let's play. Ah, uh, but oh well. You cannot have. Oh, you allied to a giant. Fuck you then. I'm not gonna fucking guarantee. Well, I thought you were going to. Oh, you're going to peacefully vassalize them, aren't you? You little fuck. You little fuck. Should have annexed it. I shouldn't have. Oh crap. No crap. Well, I'll cancel this thing then temporarily. Let's go revoke this shit. I need my points. Shit's important. Right, let's finish this one. Very close to finishing this one. The other one as well. And once that is done, we can finally start. Um. um Increasing technology again, which would be nice. Vassal income, yep. They have some claims and some stuff. By the way, ooh, look at Karzan. They actually have some claims. All over the border with the Timurids. Are you allied with anyone scary? Yes, you are. Well, never mind. We're not going to attack the Timurids then. Because that would be great if I can attack the Timurids, conquer this shit, and sell it to Karzan. That would be awesome. Uh, but nope. Uh, do you have any claims? Nope. 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 Well, you do have those cores, but those cores are on the vagina gar, and that's that shit's scary. So, I mean, look at the vagina gar. God, that's scary. I should probably go talk to them about friendship. Oh god, yeah. Now they're now they're back into the conquest mode. They are just conquering everyone. I am most likely going to be on the shit list. So, it's it's the succession still disputed? It is. Uh, they have how much? Oh wow, we have equal prestige to them. So could I even claim their throne? Let's find out. Fortifications. Okay, claim, claim, claim. <laughs> I'm so over my limit now. Okay, nice. Now we got that one. Uh, so basically, now the annexation of these guys should go super quick. Yeah, very quickly. Which is an issue, because I do need to start the uh, annexation of Gujarat. We can increase it by 10, and then by another... No, still need to wait another 10 years or so before we can get this annexation going. Unless, there is... Unless they have a revolt. If they have a revolt, then we can annex them. So... We could try and get enemy of enemy though. Yeah, Vaginagar's rival. Let's do the stupid thing and put Vaginagar as our own rival. 
They are, they are, well, do we already have enemy of enemy? I don't know. Well, they have these guys as an enemy, so what if I try to convince the world that I should have them as an enemy as well? Come on. Why not? What has I misunderstood? Why not? Why can't I make Delhi a rival? Because they have a truce? It's weird. Shit's weird indeed. Oh well, whatever. Alright, so we are over the limit now, which is not nice. Uh, so Harry Ottomans, you wanna wanna can I can I have your throne, please? That is so stupid, but I'm gonna do it anyways. Because it would just be too great if we could pull it off, so... It, uh, it must happen. Yeah, so, I mean, we've... Uh, the, the only issue about the fact that we keep claiming these thrones, though, is the fact that, I mean, we're sabotaging for any future alliances. Uh, look at Persia, for example. We have a minus 50 with them. They still like us, though, so we should actually probably go talk to them about love. Let's get some love going here. Make sure they like me, because they're my only ally at this point. Only real ally. Well, pretty much, aren't they my only ally? I've sort of been traitorous towards my uh, all the other ones. Yeah. Well, I guess I could try and cancel my marriage with Delhi. That would get rid of one of those. And that's something. Because you don't want to be my vassal, do you? No. Too damn much taxes. Yeah, we're just going to be fighting you from this point on anyways. And there's no way we're going to be friendly with you. So let's just break that shit. Temporarily cancel that. Let's go break the line. I have broken so many marriages in this game, it's getting stupid. Oh god. Yep. Ah, oh, crap. Oh well. Yeah, we're not doing very well at the moment, are we? Okay, so now at least we have only one over, which is an acceptable thing. That's gonna change though once we get rid of some of these vassals of ours. He died. Let's get a new one. Yeah, we are. I mean, the fact that we are spending so much points on so much different random crap is that we are really lagging behind in terms of technology. Compared to our sort of Indian rivals, though, we are pretty decent, but, um, yeah, in general, this is not that great. Might have to rethink certain things at some point here. Come on, good rat! Let me annex you, please! God, I hate that annexed vassal thing, it's so annoying! Uh, the main problem is, of course, that they, um... Oh, we're so close! God damn, fuck! Oh. I think 55, if if my math is correct. No, that's not gonna be enough. Fuck! No, that's not gonna be enough at all. We have to wait, wait even further. Ah. God damn it. I don't know of any other different... And I don't know of any other thing I can do to get my relations up. I simply do not know. I feel like, yeah, we do need that enemy of enemy thing. So your enemy is Delhi. Why is not? Why is my enemy not Delhi? Why can I not choose who my enemies are? Seriously. Why can't I put them on the list? There we go, finally. Okay, are you, they going to be my enemy now? You gonna, are you going to prove that? I put the people you don't like on the enemy list, so, I mean... Should you prove that? So the Ottomans still have a dispute of succession, which is nice. I approve of that. Alright, so I'm starting to get some money now. Let's go ahead and build some... Uh, actually, we should probably build some armories. Yeah. Get some armories, and we'll build some temples. Yeah, and these Turkic provinces here as well. Oh god, I just completely ran out of money. That was not intended, but it happened anyways. Oh well. Uh, oh yeah, Bengali... Oh, Bengali Patriots! Uh, I No, I don't actually like that. Uh, can I attack you soon? No, it's gonna be a while. Two years. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Can I just kill these rebels? I don't like that they have these rebels. I Like, I would like it if I had Bengal as a vassal, but the thing is, I don't have Bengal as a vassal, so... This is not truly that great. They wouldn't accept it, would they? They would, actually. Okay. Let's actually just go kill them. Yeah, that's... Well, I don't know. Could I still annex them? But that's... Well, yeah, that would... Eh. 
I don't know. Are we, by the way, are we done with that idea? No, we're not. So we'll lose the administrative then. Uh, by the way, just just as a theoretical thing, what would actually happen if we, if the Ottoman Sultan died? It would just be regencies. I don't. We wouldn't actually gain anything. Disappointing. Very, very disappointing. Do we have like a Cassus Belli to go kill them or something like that? Like Force Union? No, no. Fuck. There's no way we're going to be able to win against the Ottomans anyway. So I mean. Oh yeah, we need to talk to our vassals about friendship. Stupid vassals and your lack of friendship. Seriously though. Oh, Gertrude likes me! Why? I... <laughs> Ooh, the vassal thing went away. Why did the vassal thing go away? Fuck yeah, let's annex these guys. Oh, finally, if they're so long, we can annex them. And uh, these annexations should go quick, because we have both an idea that helps us, and we have a uh, advisor that helps us, so... Yeah, I like it. So yeah, come on, Bengal, please, um... Please, okay, I don't know what that... So I, I didn't know that happened, so I guess it just is a cooldown or something like that? I don't know. Anyways, let's talk to these guys as well, then. Yeah, fuck you. No, 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 no. We need. We do need to annex them, but yeah, we need to talk to all of these people. Nobles are worried. Ah, what? Why? Should have read why, but I didn't. Oh well. Come on, integrations. Come on now. Let's do this. I don't know, I'm gonna have a cast of spell eye. Okay, uh, yeah, but really, there's nothing we can do now, right now. We just need to sit around and do nothing for a while, I think. Uh, there's none of those fancy things we can do to make these guys like me, but we. This shouldn't be a problem, though. We should be able to just increase our relations to the point where we can just get it, so. I'm not too, too worried. Is it because I don't have enough? I don't. I do not have enough prestige. Is that why I'm not going to be able to claim the Ottoman throne? Because they have more prestige than I have. That might be the thing. I don't know though. Ha! Huh. Another round of Bengali patriots. Sweet. I have no idea. Whatever. I think it was worth a try though. Because I mean, just imagine how awesome that would be if we could fucking personal put the Ottomans into a personal union as Karaman. That would be great. But eh. I don't see that happening right now. Uh, ooh, this episode's been going on for a while. No, no, it's not been that. It's not. It hasn't been that long, but it's been long enough to the point where I want to end it. So thank you so much for watching this episode, and until next time, bye.